Japanese developers have unveiled the latest in robotic technologies, which they hope will help in the cleanup of the crippled Fukushima nuclear power plant, damaged in the 2011 earthquake and tsunami. This robotic exoskeleton suit allows its wearer to lift weights of up to 60 kilograms, all the while protecting them from harmful radiation and monitoring their vital signs. Although it was originally invented to assist Japan's fast growing elderly population, it has now been adapted for use inside disaster zones. Japanese researchers weren't focusing on developing robots that could be used in nuclear reactors. The Fukushima accident provided a big incentive to robot developers to take on this new area. Other devices born from the research and development departments of nine of the organizations involved include this small size mobility robot. Named Sakura, it gives its operators multiple angle views so that they can use its remote controlled arms to open the valves of high pressured pipes. At the moment, the reactors are thought to be in a stable condition, but completely dismantling the plant is a job that will take several decades. We have a long struggle ahead of us until we finally end this crisis, so we hope our robot will replace the human workers inside the crippled nuclear plant. Japan may not yet have recovered from the Fukushima disaster, but at least these technological advances are offering a glimmer of hope. Tom Bailey, BBC News.